in the very contentious way of now, the way that game news is being disseminated to the masses, what is the best way for you to get to straight dope so you can make the best gaming decisions? Well, we're gonna tell you how right now. Let's get into it. What's up, peoples? What's up, peoples? What's up, peoples? It is your boy, MM2K, back again with another one. Hey, do me a huge favor, and you know the deal. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Rock those bells for notifications, please, so you know when your boy's dropping these doses. I appreciate all of y'all straight up, because guess what? I'm not too proud to ask. Okay, so here's the thing. Um, and me doing YouTube and content creation as much as I have for the last few years, I've come to realize something. I've come to realize that there are people with different agendas when they're out here disseminating gaming news or gaming information, and that's okay. Everybody has to have a niche or everybody has to have a product placement or they don't have a purpose. If everybody's out there doing the exact same thing the exact same way, then that's conveyor belt to me and it, it, it makes uh, anything within that realm stagnant, right? But what happens is sometimes people aren't always that upfront and honest about what their intentions are opposed to the news and information that they're disseminating. Now, what do I mean by that? You got a lot of people that are wood buffing for pieces of plastic so they can get clicks, so they can get ad revenue, so they can get attention. You get people that flip flop. You get inconsistencies, you get things like that. Well, I'm gonna tell you what, there are very few sources out there that you can trust that'll say the same thing on the mic that they will say the same thing off the mic. A lot of your favorite YouTubers, a lot of your favorite content creators, a lot of the, your favorite publications online, they're not being straight up and honest with you about their interpretation about how they truly feel about this stuff. That's where agendas can go wrong. And when you're not out here servicing the people and trying to give them the straight dope, then I can't cap for that. And I'm gonna tell you what, you can say what you want about my brethren and the broadband bullies. We give you that straight dope and we give it to you in an entertaining way. Now, sometimes that form of entertainment may not be for everybody, but it's just, 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 it's just jokes. All right. And that's fine. Everything can't be, like I said earlier, conveyor belt and for everybody. But what I can tell you is that as an extension to the very entertaining, very high energy information, gaming news and sorts, that you get from the broadband bullies, there's also the PNTS network where I'm also affiliated. And one of the premier shows that we do on the PNTS network is a little show by the name of Scram Punk's Podcast. Okay, you can see it here in the, in the graphic. Scram Punk's Podcast represents a group of gamers, dedicated, hardcore gamers that love the community, that have a lineage in the community, right? That's just giving you that straight dope. And we telling you how we feel. You're getting the same MM2K on the mic that you get off the mic. You're getting the same dirt griggity that you get on the mic, you get off the mic. You're getting the same lethals that you get on the mic, you get off the mic. And you're getting the same snow bunny that you get on the mic, that you get off the mic. We're not souping anything up. We're not pulling the wool over your eyes so you can click on our show. We just want you to be informed, whether after being informed, you agree with us wholeheartedly or not. That's our agenda here, is being consumer advocates. And if that's what you're looking for, if you're looking for the gaming news being talked talked about by a group of gamers that really care about the future of the community as in whole, we look at it past our favorite console or our, our favorite platform. We look at gaming as a whole. If that's what you want, then look no further than Scram Punk's podcast, okay? We air every Wednesday, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on my homie Dirk Griggity's channel. The show that we did last night, which I'm gonna leave a link to on the bottom of this uh, uh, video or the bottom of this page here, 
was a very fantastic show. We covered everything from the uh, the Phil Spencer, Satya Nadella interviews with Fortune Magazine. We talked about a lot of the, 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 the headway that Nintendo's making. We talked about PlayStation 4 breaking 100 million consoles. And we talked about the state of gaming as in this newfound hate for shooters, particularly Wolfenstein, Youngblood, Rage 2, a whole bunch of other stuff. We cover it all. And again, this is coming from passionate gamers that are passionate about the direction of gaming as a whole. So for a moment, if you're willing to come out of your silo and not just listen to Phil Church or, or uh, uh, Yoshida Church, you know what I'm saying? Or Nintendo Church. If you're coming to listen to a diverse panel, and when I say diverse, I don't mean aesthetically, I'm talking about diversity of thought. If you're looking for a diverse panel with diverse opinions, come to Scram Punk's podcast every Wednesday, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And you can catch it on demand, like I said, on my homie Dirk Riggity's channel. Check us out now. It was a fantastic show by the Power Panel that gives it to you raw, baby. Check out that link, and I hope you will enjoy it. And leave a comment too. Give us what your thoughts are. You know what I'm saying? Again, the show is just bigger than us on the panel. We often reference to the, the chat and to the different opinions that people may give to us directly. It's bigger than us. It's about the game community in whole. And with that being said, I hope you enjoy the content. I hope you're partaking it all the time. And even if you can't join us live, just check us out on, on Dark Grigody's platform. You know what I'm saying? On demand. And we're also on audio podcasts. We're on most of your favorite audio podcasts. Just look up hashtag Scrampunks. And with that being said, I appreciate y'all giving me your time to check us out. Listen to what I have to say in regards to the diverse nature of our gaming community, the true diverse nature. And with that being said, you guys all have a wonderful, wonderful gaming day. Peace.